provide most accurate forecast from WMBF First Alert meteorologist Andrew Dockery. All right, as we're going throughout the Monday, of course, we always want to get you updated with the tropics. Brand new tropical update this morning. Good news, 70 and 80% chance of development over the next two and seven days. Uh, this working to the north, though, and a tropical depression likely to form, but will not pose any threat to us here in the United States. So we'll keep an eye. We'll let you know when that tropical depression forms. But even with the other chance of development, that system that brought the rain overnight last night, it's actually going to gain some strength and a little bit of circulation. And as that moves to the northeast, it may need to be watched here. 30% chance over the next two and seven days. Once again, no threat to us. Let's talk about the next 24 hours. It is Monday. I know the coffee maker probably working overtime this morning. Good news. The rain has started to die down. We've had a couple of isolated showers still across Brunswick County, but here in Ori in the Grand Strand and even in the PD, we are dry. Still some fog out there though. Morning checklist 72 degrees right now in Florence. Kids heading back to school 89 for the high temperature with rain chances at 40%. There's more clouds around with that system that's moving through Myrtle Beach 86 for your high temperature today. You'll notice the worst of the visibility set up already across portions of Hartsville, across portions of Florence as well, and even Bennettsville. So where kids are heading back to school, that's where the worst of the fog is. So keep an eye on the bus stops this morning. All that rain gets out of here like we've talked about. We'll get a nice break middle of the day. There should be plenty of sunshine temperatures in those mid to upper 80s. And then as we head into the afternoon, expect showers and storms to develop and potentially a strong line of storms moving through our area before weakening after sunset. With that, can't rule out some strong winds and heavy rain. There is a very low severe weather risk for any storm that does form today. Muggy meter wise, cold front moves through and it drifts just far enough south to where we're going to get a little bit of a break from the humidity, not tonkering miserable conditions today, but refreshing conditions for August by Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. The picks of the week, honestly, come as we go into the middle and end of the work week before that humidity returns back on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So your next three days we will keep a couple of showers around for tomorrow afternoon, 86 and 88, but then Wednesday and Thursday, no rain to speak of. We're talking a 0% chance 86 for Wednesday, 88 inland and then notice Thursday holding on to temperatures in the mid 80s. Just an isolated shower late across our area. Of course, we're keeping an eye on that sunrise. Going to be a little bit harder to see this morning. You'll notice right now the inlet, some of those clouds pushing offshore. Still some of that dense fog though in Conway and portions along 501 as you're heading up to Florence.